Hey, today I got something probably most of you have never had. We're going to do a turkey and crawfish Cajun boil. That's right, if you watch my channel, you've seen me do low country boils before, but today we're gonna to drop almost a 15 pound turkey in there. Whole way, whole new way to do turkey. So I've got 25 pounds of meat today to cook in this video. I hope you'll stay with me. It's gonna be a lot of fun, and I'm gonna caution you right up front. If you're one of those people that likes your turkey with that skin all crispy, it's not gonna be that way, but it's gonna taste incredible. I think that's probably enough. It's taking about a half hour. It's windy here today, a little cool. You can see we got a nice roaring boil. Gonna add one pound, slap your mama seafood seasoning. Two pounds, slap your mama seafood seasoning. Here what I've got, Zatarain's shrimp and crab boil in a bag. Adds great flavor. We're going to add one, two, three, four of those. Now I'm coming in with the Zatarain's shrimp and crab boil concentrate. Now ordinarily I would use three of these, but every store I went to, including the seafood market, that's it, two, that's it. Now I've got six limes that we've cut in half. Just gonna squeeze some juice from each one, drop them down in here. And by the way, I think when it boils, it's gonna get plenty of juice in it anyway. So how about we just pour the rest of them in there? What we got here? Six sweet onions cut in half. Three full heads, the cloves of garlic. Let's get all these goodies in here. And now, just give it a stir. And what I'm going to do is bring this back up to a a, what's it called? Rolling, roaring boil before we put that turkey in. It's been maybe five minutes. We're okay to touch that. You can see we got that nice boil going on. I've got 14 and three quarter pound turkey here and one turkey neck. We're gonna boil this three and a half minutes per pound, and then we'll check the temp. Here we've got a 2.7 pound, already smoked, honey, Kentucky legend ham. All I'm going to do is slice this up, and you know where it's going, right? And then we've got some smoked andouille sausages. I like to just cut them in thirds. It's easier for people to manage. You don't have to cut them at all. You're gonna have two pounds of this, 2.7 pounds of that Kentucky ham, almost a 15 pound turkey. Got some more of these guys. We're talking food party. Now we got our andouilles already. Now by my calculations, this should take about 52 minutes. We'll find out soon enough. It's been 42 minutes. I've got some red taters here. I need these guys to boil for 10 minutes. So that's why I'm putting them in now. We'll get the lid back on it. We'll check the temperature of this turkey in 10 minutes. It's been 52 minutes. Now, I've never done this, so I want to check this turkey to see what the temp is. Boy, it sure is tender. It's plenty done. It says it's 200. As you know, it only has to be 165. So we're going to turn the fire off. Now we're going to put our ham in there that we made. You'll see a couple pieces are missing because Sadie got them. 
Then we're going to put that in Dewey in there. On Dewey and Dewey. Look what I got here. These are pre-cooked. They're already purged and pre-cooked. Five pounds of crawdads. Look at a beautiful color on them. Just going to stir all this goodness up. I can't wait. Like a kid in a candy store. I'm going to put the lid back on this and we're going to let it just sit here for about 45 minutes. Soak up the deliciousness. Oh man, I almost forgot one key ingredient. We've got three sticks of Irish butter. Irish butter. Now let's get that lid back on. Hey, it's been 45 minutes. So we cooked it, it was 52, 55 minutes, and then we let it sit here in all this delicious seasoning for another 45. Now look, I told you at the beginning of this video, this turkey is not gonna be the kind you bake or smoke the skin on it. It's not gonna be good. There. Can you see that turkey? Let me see if I can get it up here. Everything else is on top of it. I did want to show you so you would know. What we're going to do is I'm going to take this turkey in. You can see that. You see how it's falling apart? Now look, look at that. There's the skin on this turkey. See, we're going to discard this skin. We're going to take the skin off. We're going to take the turkey out, slice it all up, platter this up, and give it a taste test. It's here. Just look at it. I, I know I already said this. I'm like a kid in a candy store. I don't know where to start. Let's start with the turkey. Look here. It just, it, it just shredded apart. <laughs> I'm going to try a crawfish. I'm so excited. Okay, so I've never eaten a crawfish. Break it? Never? Never. You break it? You suck the head? And then you eat the cow. Where do I break it? Right in half. Incredible Cajun seasonings. Hey, not hot. I thought it might be a little hot with the two packs of the Slappy Mama. Let's try the sausage. I'm telling you, this is to die for. We got almost 25 pounds of meat here if I did the math properly. Mm. Ham is incredible. It's like the head. Yeah. All right. Oh, I know everybody's like, what's the crawfish like? They're going to be awesome. You know it. The crawfish was delicious. Let's try the turkey. All right. Let me get. Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. It's really, <laughs> really moist. I'm telling you, this is like Christmas dinner. Crawfish are awesome. We got those taters over here. They're done. <laughs> it's like fit for a king. And it I has think it's great flavor. It's like you can taste the Cajun flavor and it is so moist. I never eat the white meat, but this right white meat is like super moist. Okay, I'm gonna try an andouille sausage. Oh holy crap. That's my god face. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. 